don't really have a particular reason why I'm coming. I just wanna. Good morning everyone and happy Monday. Today is the first day of me breaking my vlogs up in two day segments. I don't know how much organizing I'm gonna get done today because I have to take pictures of things that I'm gonna be selling tomorrow so I can put that out on Instagram and YouTube and Facebook to advertise for my sales, for my live sale on YouTube Tuesday. And you're watching this on Wednesday, so it was on Tuesday. Anyway, um, I also, I have, I think 12 eBay orders to ship. I have emails to answer. I have everything ready for whatnot, so that's done. And that sale was also on Tuesday. I'm wanting, wanting to film a video for my second channel, which I do have a second channel. It's the Misty Show. I I not I, I posted a video up there on Monday, and um, I'm filming one for going up on there. It's just it's non-reselling related things, so it's just kind of silly things that I like places that I go, things that I like that have nothing to do with the reselling content. So that's the Misty Show. The link is in the description down below. Probably today, after I get some of those things done, I'm going to um, start pulling some things for next week's sale. And um, one thing that I said that I would do would, would be have you do that with me. So we're going to go over to the shelf and to the shelves, walk around and pick 25 things to sell in next Tuesday sale. I'll put the date somewhere on the screen. When that, it's every Tuesday. Every Tuesday at 1 o'clock Eastern, right here on this channel, I have a YouTube sale. Um, so we'll pick those things. And as I'm scanning the shelves, if you see anything that you might be interested in that maybe catches your eye that I didn't grab, then send me an email, thriftyjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com and you know, maybe we can work out a deal. I also need to edit a video for this channel. So I've got a lot of stuff to do today, but I'm going to go ahead and grab those eBay orders and I'll show you what sold over the weekend. Before I do that though, I am going to get into this coffee. I ordered this coffee from, it's a coffee sampler from, what was that? Four Rivers Coffee. And we've got some different flavors. We've got butter crunch, mint chocolate chip. That sounds kind of good. Maple spice, vanilla spice, Sunday coffee. This is toffee crunch. French toast. Coconut chocolate. See, I don't know if I like the coconut. Ooh, what's this? Cookie jar. Salted caramel cookie. These sound yummy. Let's try this butter crunch. I got Paula's mug here. Paula's mug that she sent me. My Mae West mug. We're going to put that in. Get that going so our coffee maker can make gurgly sounds. So let's get our coffee. And then I will pull the eBay orders. Well, it is darn good. It is very good. You got to put a little bit of a, of cream and the can, you know, in your coffee. Oh, look what I ordered for myself off of Amazon or eBay. I don't remember. It's my boyfriend, Pedro Pascal, holding little baby Grogu. <laughs> look at him. And his head bobbles. He's a bobblehead. That's for me. And I also, I, I did pull the eBay sales I had one thing that I cannot find. So, and I looked and it was listed a long time ago and had sold and eBay had listed it again. Or I, I don't know. I, I'm not going to, listen, I don't want to throw eBay under the bus. Maybe I listed it again, but I had to cancel that order. I don't like to do that. That's not good, but I did have to cancel one of the orders because I can't find it. I looked, I tripled, doubled, every, looked everywhere. And then I looked at my eBay solds and it had already had sold. So... That's not good. But I did get a little thing of friend mail from Beth Bendit. So I'm going to open this up real quick. I'm a professional. I have my uh, camera just kind of balanced on something. So hopefully you won't fall over. But this is from Beth. Beth, where do you live? She lives in Pennsylvania. Oh, it looks like a yellow Mr. Fluffer pants. Hi, Misty. Saw this and thought of you. I really enjoy watching your videos, vlogs. You really brighten my day. Love your commentary as you wander the aisles of when, when you're shopping. Makes me laugh and makes me wish and makes me smile, which has really helped me since I've had a tough past year. I'm so sorry. Here. Beth. Everybody give Beth a hug. Come on. 
Get in a little closer. Ugh, I about, I about picked up this and started drinking out of it. But Beth, we just all gave you a hug. I, here at my ADHD, I just saw this squirrel. I got this for Mark. I'm a little engineer. He is, he is an engineer. That was, I almost drank out of that. There's nothing in it. But anyway, um, love your sparkling personality. Um, scratches to Maybelle and Mr. Fluffer Pants and hugs to Mama. Mama Kitty. She doesn't like hugs. She doesn't really like to be touched, but I do the best that I can. Oh, <laughs> red hot mama. She sent me a towel that said hot stuff. Hot. It's hot. I this is a good towel too, Beth. This is a good, this is an acceptable towel. It, it has um, absorbing properties. It isn't like, I don't like a hand towel or a, I don't like a tea towel. Hot step. Thank you, Beth. Every time I use this towel, I will think of you. So that's going to go home with me. And I really do appreciate she wrapped it up like a little present. Thank you, Beth. Here. Give you another big hug. All right. I'm going to do the eBay sales. Out of Paula. Let me drink out of Paula's cup. Oh. I washed that. That sticker didn't, get, didn't come off. Okay. So I did sell some of the light fixtures that I just listed. This one was the porcelain bottom. I've got another one I need to list. This one too has some damage in the um, the glass. It has um, a crack in it. I and I disclosed that in the listing. And I'll put the I'll put the what they sold for um, up on the screen. This one has that brass. So no wall sconce. This one, the globe, um, had a little bit of some fissures in it as well, which I did mention in the listing. We sold, I think it was this one. Oh, let me double check to make sure. Okay, it was this one. I had another one that was similar. Um, this little cast iron bus. Look at that little driver. You see him on each side? That's really cool. So this sold. My little um, Austrian bats. Bates, bats. She's a whistler. See? It looks like she's she's whistling. She sold. This 111 Skin, this vitamin C booster, that sold. And they left me a message saying that it was a gift, so I will wrap it as such. Um, this Vintage 7-Up Ephemera. Oh, gosh, several years ago, I went to a, an estate sale. It was an estate sale of someone that I knew her, and her father had passed away. But he retired from 7-Up, and I got a lot of this really cool 1970s 7-Up um promotional pieces and some more makeup this is the complex culture good glow i think it's bl a blush duo um this is a lawless forget the filler lip plumping line smoothing gloss this is hydrating lip gloss lip gloss by lucky chick this little studebaker um Every time I say Studebaker, I think of Sugar Bakers from Designing Women. But Studebaker coin, um, I think it's a Danbury Mint or Franklin Mint. One of the two, but I'll put the description right there. And then Lynn, who is a viewer, she purchased. I've had this forever. It Actually, it fell off. I was looking at my shelves, and I was like, that's not even on there anymore. And I relisted it, and Lynn bought this. This is a treat. Do you guys remember Mad Magazine? This one is from 1988. It's in really nice condition too. So she got that and these. These just, I had a soft spot. Cindy and I found these. Actually, Cindy found them and she was like, you want these? And I was like, yes. They, they just are memories. These are old um, Happy Meal toys from McDonald's. Don't you remember those when you put it and then you'd scratch the top of it? with your pencil and it would leave that decal like on your paper. So Lynn, I had two of them and Lynn bought them both. Oh, I just, that's just, it's like memory. Sometimes I buy things and I know that they're not worth a ton of money, but gosh darn it, I see it and I think somebody else would like that. So I, I don't know, I kind of feel like, sometimes you feel like you're rescuing things from maybe being thrown away and it can spread joy to somebody else that maybe hadn't thought about that thing for a long time. So I am gonna get all of these things um, 
packaged up and we'll get them ready. I'm kind of, uh, I have a lot to do today, but I'm kind of wanting to possibly leave here a little early because I need to go to Walmart because I'm all out of Amy's enchiladas. I got to get some of that, of those. And I kind of want to go over to, um, I always call it Michael's, Marshall's to check out their, I haven't been there in a couple weeks, so I kind of want to go in there. So if I can get, if I'm a good girl and I get all my stuff done, then maybe we can go over there. We'll see. Well, I got those eBay orders all ready to go and I answered some emails and I noticed I had three more orders. One of them, uh, one of them is going to be a little tricky to ship. I mean, not, not bad, but well, let me show you. Okay. So the same person bought the G man, the radio bank robberies, and he also bought this. So he must be like a gangster collector guy. So he bought those, those, and then we sold the bat. Here is a tip. When you go to garage sales and you see these aluminum bats, look them up. So this one is a D. Marini. I know nothing about bats. And you can see it's been used. The grip is still really nice on it. Um, but if you look up special softball 214 DIA CF, I mean, if you, it gives you all kinds of things that you can that you can put in your listing. But this, I think I took a best offer of like $80. And I think we probably paid a dollar for it at a yard sale. Um, Now about four years ago, it's just been sitting on the shelf. So not like hard to ship, but I mean, I may have to get creative with the box. I'm balanced, look at me. This is, this is a recipe of Missy to fall. But we're going to get these shipped, or we're going to add them to our pile. I did list, um, I think, six more things. I, I created some drafts uh, yesterday, uh, some more of the makeup products. So I just kind of made my drafts go live, some of them. Then I'm going to film. <laughs> I'm going to open up some blind bags. <laughs> That's fun. That's fun for me, but it's going to go up on my second channel because it's not reselling related, but let me go ship these. Oh, this is great because look, I have a box that will work. This is a box that something else came in. And I think, I'll put you down. I think it might work. Let's see. I mean, I'm gonna have to, no, 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 uh, it's not gonna work. I mean, just, it just barely. Well, that is, oh well. Well, we'll have to figure something else. Okay, I probably should have showed you what I did, but I didn't. But I just basically took a long cardboard box. Well, I wrapped the bat in paper first. I took a long, a long cardboard box, rolled it around it, and then cut it to make it fit. And then I used two of these big, huge poly bags. I get these huge poly bags. Let me show you how big one is from you pack and ship right there is their information but the you pack and ship these large poly bags and then you can just you know tape a couple of them together so it closes in that box makes it look a little bit nicer that's all ready to go wasn't too hard didn't take me too long so honestly check out the bats if you pick one up and it seems like it's pretty lightweight look it up even like little league bats I couldn't imagine spending $200 on a bat, but they do. So this weighs two pounds and two ounces. So check out the bats. Yard sale season is almost here where I live. Well, I did not get to picking things for Tuesday sale. My headband keeps falling down. So we'll do that tomorrow. I filmed a, a video for my second channel. I've done my eBay orders. I didn't even get my video edited, but I'm getting ready to leave so I can go get Amy's enchiladas from Walmart because we love Amy's enchiladas.
Diane. I'm going to incorporate this somehow in my live sales. Michael will love it. Oh, Diane. Diane, you have created a monster. But I'm going to do something with this and my whatnot. Or my live sales. I don't know what, but you'll have to tune in. You have to tune in and find out what that will be. Diane sent me a message and she said that you can hook this up to karaoke. <gasps> That'd be fun. Okay, so I'm going to get going here so I can go over to Walmart to get some Ames enchiladas. I don't know that I'm going to have time to go into uh, Marshall's, but we'll see. All right, I'm getting out of the car. It's a little far over, but we're over it. I keep calling it Michael's, and it's Marshall's. Really, I don't really have, don't really have a particular reason why I'm coming. I just wanna, I just wanna. All right, looking at the, some of the Eastern spring decor. These are kind of cute. They're like, oh, they're Ray Dunn by Magenta. I had shown these in one of my other vlogs and they have these like little robin eggs and these things. I did buy this one. I think it's still in its packaging. I haven't done anything with it. One thing that I don't need to be looking at is the shoes, but I'm gonna. These are cute. I have some similar to that. Those are really cute for 29. All right, I did get me this purse for, was it 20, I think it was 19.99. But I'm going to Vegas in a couple of weeks and I wanted something I could use as a crossbody that wouldn't be too big. So I got that. These, if you go to a Marshalls, I think they might have them at TJ Maxx too, but these Gal Pal tie-dye poofs for the shower, they are the best. Highly, highly recommend. And they're only $4.99, you get two of them. This is neat. I don't need any more, no more mugs, Misty. But I can get one, maybe. Look at the Aristocats with a little, with a little stir right there. For peeps sake. How much is this? $4.99. That is a nice big happy mug that I don't need, so I'm not gonna buy it. See back there's little Grogu. I have him. How much is he on sale for now? He's on sale. So he's still, well, that's how much I paid for him. He's $16. And then look at you, scary looking Chewbacca. Hi. I am gonna get me some of these. I needed some more of these hangers. Martha, Martha, how much are your hangers? $9.99, how much are the non-Martha hangers? $14.99, well, Martha. Well, but you get 35 and you get 25 in that one. So 25 in Bombay, they're also $9.99, so. Maybe we'll just go ahead and get Martha. Oh my gosh, look at how cute these little canisters are. They're little mushrooms. They're $19.99. Those are adorable. I don't know what I'd do with them, but they're very, very cute. I've been wanting to get a new shower curtain, so I like this one at $16.99. It's very colorful for spring, so I like that. And you know, when you get a new shower curtain, replace the liner as well so i'm gonna grab those too yeah and i gotta look down the toy aisle to see if we see any any blind bags oh, look at those babies what do you do do you feed that baby it looks like you do she's got some food right there i'm not seeing any blind bags oh look at you you're a fuss fuzzy fashion bff did you oh, oh my gosh Maybe I should get this purse instead. Oh my gosh, what are you saying? We only have a llama. Au revoir. Au revoir. I guess they're all llamas. Oh, you could have a cat. They just have the llama. It's nice and fuzzy. I don't think I should get that one for Vegas. I think the one that I got will go with more of my outfits. Haribo, backpack, gold bears. There are six, oh, it's real littles. There are six surprises in here. This is becoming a problem. Oh, look at you, what do you do? Wake up. Wake up. Wake up, fella. Oh, look at this. Is he a gooey guy? Oh, I kinda wanna stretch his arms. Look, they've got these gooey. 
He's super goopy and he's super squishy. Oh my gosh, look at the insides of their bodies. Oh man, I wanna pull you, your arms. Oh, your head isn't smushy, just your arms. These guys though, they have stuff inside their bodies jiggling around. That's $16.99, look at that. That's just, that's going a little too far for me. I, no, I'm not, I gotta draw a line somewhere. Although I really do wanna play with that. Look at this little puppy. Oh, but look, she even comes with her own little poo poo. This little puppy does. It'll. It's a. It's a poop a lot. I poop in all different languages. Well, I spoke too soon because look what I found. Now look at this. This is a crybaby. It's in this little blind bag. It's an official crybaby product, but she's got magic tears, and apparently you could make her cry. And there's 12 of them to collect. I'm tempted. I might get that one. And then there's, I don't know what this is. It's some kind of a critter. Bull, bull balloons. But do you smush them and they, they blow bubbles? Mm, I'm, I'm kind of tempted for that too. But look, here's the mini brands. I only one I want is Grogu. I don't care about the other ones, how much they want for it. This is $7.99. There's um, five of them in there. The only one that I want is Grogu. So I'm not going to take the risk spending the money on that on my second channel i'm opening all these up so i think i might grab those for that okay i'm here at walmart getting amy's enchiladas well you know i had i couldn't leave walmart without getting some grogu ears headband because may the 4th is coming soon and i can wear them then it makes sense to me. People are kind of looking at me like I'm a little crazy. I will wear these in public. I do not care. Walmart was great. I got some blind bag toys for my second channel. I got the Amy's enchiladas. I got my Grogu ears. I am good to go. That will be the end of today. I will uh, get Maybelle and Mr. Fluffer pants at some point, either tonight or tomorrow. Don't you fear. Don't you fret. Because I know that a lot of people just mainly want to see them. You're really going for a ride here today. But anyway, if you haven't watched The Mandalorian, I highly recommend it. Just so, but just be, just so you know, Pedro Pascal, my oh boyfriend. Oh my gosh! My boyfriend. Just as long as you know that, you'll be, you'll be fine. So Fluffer and I are getting ready to go to bed. He's just a big ball of fluff. Say so good night to everybody, Mr. Fluffers. Okay. Good morning, Maybell. Maybell. Oh, hello. Good morning. Good morning, Maybell. I know. I know. Tell everybody, my mom is needs to give me a treat, cause I'm a very good girl. It's like the same thing. It's like a Groundhog's Day. Oh. Okay, let's get your treat. Maybe I'll daddy breaks your treats in half. Mommy gives you a full one. Who do you like more? Mommy or daddy? Mommy or daddy? Which one? <laughs> oh, both. Okay, there you go. Okay, I'm going to get to the shop. And so I'm not going to dilly dally here because we've got to pick things. We're going to pick things, at least a few things, because, you know, this vlog is going to be, you know, several days. So we're at least going to go and scan the shelves and pick a few things for um, next week's sale. And again, if you see anything that you might be interested in or you say, hey, you, you should pull this, you should pull that, or what's this, what's that, go ahead and put those in the comments. And, you know, it gives me an idea of what some things that maybe I'm not thinking about pulling and that maybe I should. All right, I'm going to get to, well, you know what, I'm going to go to Starbucks because it's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. I didn't tell you happy Tuesday. How rude. But today's Tuesday, so it's Starbucks Tuesday. I'm going to head to Starbucks, get me a drink, and then we're going to get to the shop and get busy. I changed my hat, so, and I'm at the shop now. Um, it was a hat day. I needed to put a hat on today, but... Um, I have a couple eBay sales to pull, and I also wanted to come over here to the shelves. Let me turn on this light. Wanted to come over here to the shelves because Lynn saw something that she was interested in, and she sent me an email. She wants to buy this little cabbage patch. 
doll. So I'm going to pull that. And I sold this Hoosier cabinet insert swung arm flour sugar holder thing. And then one, no, not 111. I think it's this one. Clear Skin Club. Uh, I'm pretty sure. all the, That's the bad thing. All these things start looking the same. Let me check and make sure that that's what it is. Yes, it is. It is this. The Clean, clean Skin Club. That sold as well. And then this did sell too. This vase. I'm waiting on the buyer to pay. So I'm gonna, just going to leave it there for now. Um, until they, they have paid because it's kind of big and bulky and it's going to kind of be in my way. So I'm just going to leave it on the shelf, but we're going to take these over and get them shipped. Okay. So I got my eBay orders done. Oh shoot. I forgot. To, well, I'll just use one of these. I've got these baskets here. I'll use one of these and let's walk over here and we're going to pick some things for next well this coming tuesday's sale i've got this i think this is really cool these just give me a little bit of an anxiety attack okay here we go oh she was with one hand oh. huh oh there he is but look how cute he is he's a little bug oh he's cute it's mattel it's the bumble bug. So I think that would be cute. Look at the look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we're going to we're going to pull that. Um, I am going to be doing a Disney sale soon on whatnot. I'm not going to pull any of the Disney things. Um how about we do some I don't know do I do Well, let's do Rimple. We'll do the Rimple and hmm, This we'll do this girl. Well, I, I'm, I'm having a, um, actually, I'm probably going to save her for whatnot. She's Holt Howard. I only have one. I only have one of her, and she's in excellent shape. But these little Easter things I'm going to put on um, whatnot because I'm going to do an Easter sale. How about we do this? We could do this Lucite fruit. This Lucite fruit. They do glow. They fluoresce. I got to do this with one hand. So we're going to be... You're going to be going for a little bit of a, of a ride. We've got this bluebird here with the votive. So let's do that. I actually found one with the votive. Uh, let's also do a couple flower frogs. I've got a champagne colored one and a uranium glass one. We could do a brooch. I've got this really pretty Aurora Borealis one with the matching earrings. I'm trying to decide. I've got this set here. This set, the, the person never sent me their information. So maybe we'll do that set. They, they, I never got their information. So it didn't get, I didn't get paid for. So we'll try that again. I've got, see this I'll probably put with the Disney sale. It's Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs cake toppers. I've got um, these babies in a shoe. Now this shoe itself is made in Japan. Um, got Look, that baby's got glasses on. So maybe we'll do... Let's pull some of these babies. Look at her. She, they're all, well, I think most of them are naked. So let's pull out. Um, let's do three of them. Actually, we'll do her on her own. And then we'll do these two little ones as a choice. I also have this one. Maybe we can do these two as a choice and those two as a choice. We could do some salt and pepper shakers. I got these little kitty cat ones with the jeweled eyes. These are PY. I do believe they're PY. Oh no, they're Lipper and Man. Never mind. They're Lipper and Man. So we could do the Lipper and Man or we could do, I got two different kinds of strawberries. Let's do these, these, these strawberries. And let's, well, let's do the strawberries and the peaches, and we can do those as choice. Oh, and I said that we were going to do these Viking swung, swung, swung vases. And let's do a Westmoreland blue. I do believe that this is Westmoreland satin glass, possibly. I thought about these Ransburg. This is a whole 
set, a whole canister set. And then this is the cleaning can. So you would put your, um, your talcum powder in there. This is, I don't know how this goes exactly. Here is that pink stove. Should we do the pink stove? Because it does take up a lot of shelf space. I'm running out of room. Oh, and I don't know. I may put I may put her on the whatnot sale, actually. Oh, I got this cruel. This Vogue Art Cruel. It's brand new. It's never been used. Um, so we could do that. And then I did buy a couple more of the these antique yearbooks. Um, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? This is from 1916. And again, it has those pages that were not completely uh, tacked down. So I've got the 1916 one. And this is 1928. So we could do these two yearbooks. All right, I'm going to take those things over there that I just picked Oh, let's do a fairy lamp. We've not done a fairy lamp in a while. So we'll do this Fenton fairy lamp too. I'm running out of space. So I'm going to take these things down and get those um, in my area over there for my sales. Oh, like maybe we can pick a couple pieces from all this blue. We could do the Fenton cream and sugar. I got to see how many things I have and how many more things. I might add in some linens. We could do this um, tablecloth. And I might do one of these quilts. I've got a really... Like, this one's got butterflies on it. I'm not showing you a very good... Look at that. So, I might, I'm, I'm going to see how many items I have before I do anything else but I do have a couple of these pieces that I'm going to sit down right now and take pictures of for um the, I don't know I don't know this is it's Roseville Ohio it's a like a pottery I thought it was Longaberger at first but these are all things that I had at the front of the shop I got some more wall sconces here um, they were electrified, but they obviously need rewired Do I have a set of those I don't know if this is worth anything or not it's like it's made in Taiwan, but it reminds me of Billy Bob from um, Showbiz Pizza. You remember Billy Bob, or was that Chuck E. Cheese? One of the two. One of the two. So I'm going to list a few more things on eBay, and then I have my sales today. So I'll pop in after the sales today um, just to end this vlog and to kind of give you an update on how things went during the sale. And then I'm going to end this vlog because I have to edit it because it needs to go up on Wednesday with my new vlogging style slash schedule. So I think we got, we, we, we filled in a lot in these last, these past two days. So I'll pop in before I leave after my sales and then, um, I will bid you adieu. Well, I wanted to pop in here real quick. Um, I'm still, before I had my sale, I'm listing some things, but the Billy Bob. This is from Showbiz Pizza. The ones I've seen online, his little overalls are striped. This one, they're not striped. Um, the paint that's made in Ty Taiwan, there's no chips on it, but the paint is a little crude in some spots. That's not a chip. That's just where the paint isn't fully there. Um, so he's worth about $35, which is kind of weird. The, the reclaimed brass um, sconces and right now I'm listing this is made in Rose I think it's Roseville yeah Roseville Ohio this picture here water picture so I use I, I'll take the pictures on and do the listings on my phone and then I save them as a draft and then I go in and I'll show you you can go in to your let me brighten this up a little bit not too much that's a little too much you go in on your computer and you can adjust the photos. So I want to trim this one up. So I'll use this little tool right here to trim it. Trim that down there because I want to take some of that background. I know that you can like totally erase the background. I don't like to do that. Wait, And then if you hit this little sunshine looking thing, that's where you can adjust the 
you know, th that's, that's too much. You can adjust the brightness a little bit to make it just, just to clean it up a little bit. And then, you know, taking a picture of the bottom and again, oops, again, I'm just going to crop this down to where it will, um, kind of, you know, zoom in on what we want to see. I don't think that I need to, yeah, I don't need to do much with that to lighten that. But, and then that's just, that's what I do. That's what makes it faster for me to just get the pictures done. I, I did this close up so they could see that green color. Um, just to get the, the, the photos done uh, real quickly and then I can go in and I can edit those photos on my computer. To me, it's easier to do it this way than to just create the listing fully on your phone. Well, I just listed several more things on eBay, and while I was doing that, Mr. and Mrs. Toodles, they sold. So I'm going to get those ready to, I'm going to get them shipped, packaged, and ready to go. That was a great sale. Now, I paid $100 for the set, so... I'm happy with that. I did set just an example of something that I bought in an antique mall for a hundred dollars, which is which is a lot of money, but there I knew that they were worth a lot more than that, and I sold them for that. So yay. All right, the sales went well. Thank you for coming if you did. But I'm getting ready to head out here. I'm going to edit this video. To, I'm going to eat something when I get home. It's a little after 7 now. I'm going to eat something. I'm going to edit this video tonight so it can go up tomorrow afternoon. But tomorrow I have a full day of shipping, which I love. I got all these books to ship, which will be great. And everything that I sold um, during my YouTube sale earlier. So... I love a Wednesday. I do. I love a Wednesday. So um, I will be vlogging a little bit tomorrow. So we'll be doing a little bit of shipping tomorrow for tomorrow's vlog. But thank you guys so much for following along these, these past two days. And um, please subscribe if you're not subscribed. Don't forget, I do have live sales every Tuesday at 1 o'clock Eastern right here on my on this YouTube channel. I have my second channel where I put up different kinds of uh, unboxings and travel vlogs and that sort of thing. And then on Whatnot at 5 o'clock p.m. Eastern on Tuesdays, I have my Whatnot sale. And this coming week is going to be Easter. I've been pulling some things right there. You see her? That's going to be on Whatnot sale next Tuesday at 5 p.m. Eastern. But thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some charmer, yes indeed. You say that I should be in the follies, hot tamales. You say that I got a pair of eyes just like old Svengali's. I confess that I possess the sweetest charms in town. And unless I miss my guess, the boys will follow me around. I could make a music master, drop his fiddle, make a bald head, a man, part his hair in the middle. Red hot mama.